It is said that Admiral Cheng He's treasure fleet sailed through these waters on its journeys to the Horn of Africa. But this is what, a, a Chinese tomb then? Yeah, this is it look like a Chinese Because the Muslim, when they bury ourselves, we don't decorate our, our, our tombs. But this one, it is decorated. There is somebody under the ground there. About 40 years ago, there was many, many pieces all over the side of these tombs here. But now you can see only the shapes, it's here. Somebody take it off all, all of these things. But the, these things are very important right now according to the history. All the surround, the four side, this one, the other one, and the behind one here. It was all covered in they porcelain. It all was covered with the Chinese porcelain. working with the Dr. Mark Hutton, when we dig, we discover some skeleton which was not facing Mecca, and some they are facing Mecca. So the doctor of archaeologist was telling us this is a Muslim and this is a non-Muslim. The last time we were to be excavated here, it was 1987. So yeah. almost 30 years later, nothing's almost, been done. Yeah, nothing have done. My guide is taking me to meet the Sharif family. A few years ago, DNA evidence suggests that these people may be the last remaining descendants of the Chinese here on the Lamu Archipelago. We carried some names, hairs, they took our hairs, our mother's hairs, our sister's hairs. So when the tests were done, uh, what did the evidence indicate? And the result which was came, uh, so we in past saw that we are in Chinese, the blood of the Chinese. Really? Yeah. So it confirmed that you have Chinese ancestry? Yeah. Do you believe that these results are accurate? I believe. We were so very happy. Happy? Yeah. Mm. We proudly were Chinese. Really? Yeah. Are you able to speak any, any Chinese? Maybe some greeting, Miha. Yeah, others. <laughs>